Now, in order for a bomb to do its job, it needs three components. Power source, it needs an action switch, and it needs an explosive load. We wired in a photo cell like the one we found melted into the fireman's boot. So Al followed a render safe procedure and he drilled in in an attempt to disrupt the power source. Once the pipe was breached, the light hit the photo cell, closed the circuit, boom. What kind of person makes something like that? Well, bombers are eco-driven. They make bombs to gain control, get revenge, so terror. Some believe they've been betrayed by society. Or betrayed by someone they trusted. Now, Moreno was a busy boy. He had one wife in Miami, the other in Bogota. Customs inspector at Port of Miami told me that wife number two came in a week ago, high season. Maybe they found out about each other. Sounds like motive. And maybe it's time to talk to the wives. Can't you see this isn't about you finding out what happened to Al? The day Sean died, I was at a scene, a restaurant shooting, girl killed by her boyfriend. I didn't realize Sean had gone across the street to the boyfriend's apartment. He found him on the 14th floor balcony, ready to jump. Sean tried to talk him down like any good cop would do. Guy took him over the side. I saw them hit. Didn't know who it was at first. I worked that case. I insisted on it. Grief is grief. Work is work. Don't confuse the two.